All right, one last midnight. Welcome back to another episode of Ash Janeer. And we're stuck. Not really. Kind of. We do have another thruster. But I have to find the last location. I, I, I totally messed up. Uh, I totally messed up. I forgot to put a beacon. Uh, at my last landing point. And so I want to find it before I leave. And... Yeah, this is going to be interesting. Man, I swear that was it. That totally looks like where I was, but I don't know. I was on this side of the planet. I have landed at a couple other different locations, which is a problem. I don't think there's too many locations to try to land on over here. This might have been it. This might have been it. <laughs> I don't think I was that close to it. I think this was it. Yes, it rendered in. And that mountain rendered in, that was it. This was it. Yes. Okay, so it's kind of, you know, it's a little bit... I won't say cheaty, but the, the way that the world works is that if you have landed at a location you can see that it it's kind of more rendered in from orbit so let's go and get what i need to get and let's make a minor change here there was a suggestion that was made that's actually a really good suggestion so let's uh let's make a little minor change we'll get some quartz get a beacon down i believe i have enough bites for yes the drill why don't we open up the drill And I believe there's some clay very close. I'm going to have a hard time drilling through the rock if I don't do this. So let's get this taken care of right away. I haven't found clay yet, but let's get another ammonium so I can build another thruster. Oh, we found a beacon on this guy, which is awesome. So I don't, I mean, I still need clay, but uh, the purpose of getting the clay was to build the drill. But if I don't need to build the drill anymore to get the quartz, I don't need clay right now. I thought there was clay in here. I, You know, I have seen clay as I was running around. So, I'm not too sure where it was located. It might have been located up higher. I, I'm not entirely sure. Alright, let's make a minor change here. Somebody has suggested that I put the... These stones, or these, uh, these research samples on a storage. So that as they regrow back, I'm always getting them, right? I'm, I'm sticking them somewhere. And that makes a lot of sense. The problem is, is if I put the research samples on top of this platform, they're not going to automatically get into the platform. I have to put use an arm to get it into the platform. So what I could do is have an additional auto arm. And the auto arm will then turn around and uh, just put it on the storage. I, you know, I might have to come back and do this. Because I, I would want more power. Unfortunately, you know, the auto arm takes up an additional power. So I, I don't really know that I want to do this right now. I could come back and do this. I won't miss much. All right. Let's make... Another thruster or two. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and pop off a couple uh, thrusters. Make a couple of those, just in case I have uh, some sort of problem <laughs> that I might have again. 
All right, little base setup. I will fix the storage situation later. Let's go ahead and make another beacon. And let's get out of here. Get some Wolframite. Typically, I go to Kalidor for Wolframite. Let's go to DeSolo this time. It has been a really, really long time since I've been to DeSolo. Perfect. Alright, good. Let's cut a hole. I, I don't think there's going to be any kind of, you know, cave entrance on the way down. This is the clay right here. I, I don't have the facility to smelt it up, though. I could go through the process of building a smelter and stuff like that, but I have no power right now. So let's... Let's see, I also don't have an oxygenator, so... Oh, God. You see, this is why I go to Kalidor. Because it's on the surface. Uh, hopefully I'll get lucky. All right, we got lucky. Found some uh, Wolframite close to the ramp here. Which is good because I didn't really have a whole heck of a lot of space and stuff. And uh, oxygen and all that goodies. Got quartz. We found a nice little deposit. This is actually really nice. I think I can get with three pieces. What could I drop? I can drop some of this resin. I don't really need the resin anymore. Let's just put it down here. Free up a couple spaces. Alright, four pieces. We're out of here. I could get a couple more. How about I do that? How about I build a filter? And nab at least three more pieces. Well, technically I can nab four because I'm going to be using the thruster. Ooh, dang it. They're taking it off. Alright, that's it. That's all I can grab. Let's make it back home. And then build the rest of the base building pieces. Alright, home sweet home. Let's start processing up some of our goodies. Dang it. Uh, you took my hematite! <laughs> I wonder if I could, uh... I could stop this. Can I get the hematite back and use it? I can. Good. Alright, let's get uh, some resin. I did have a piece of clay here. Good, I remembered. And I had another solid fuel thruster. Good. I dropped one by the ship, but um, that's all right. And let's take care of the rest of the base building pieces. Let's just get them taken care of. So we don't have to worry about them, because I'm sure somebody's screaming, Soil Zedrifuge! <laughs> and uh, I'm, I'm sure you're right. While we're at it, we can get, you know, these little bites. These little bites will help along the way. 
Just unlock the next thing. I'm just gonna do a quick bites because I need to get resin. Yeah, so I'm sure people have been saying, you know, you can get resin off of the soil centrifuge and you don't have to be digging stuff up. And you're absolutely right. Like there's there's nothing wrong with digging stuff up. There's plenty of resources that are available to be able to dig stuff up. I am have decided to kind of, you know, get out of my rut. I'm, I'm not going to play the game exactly the way that I play the game time and time again. And so I, I just want to try some things differently. I mean, yes, I am going to use the soil centrifuge because it's a very helpful tool. But I don't think I'm going to rely on it as much. I mean, there's the auto extractors that we can get up to that would help us extract resources and collect them in a different way. There are, like I said, plenty of resources in which we can just gather manually. And it is not too big of a worry of resources or running out of resources. But I am going to build the soil centrifuge. And I probably will be using it too. Quite often. Just maybe not as much. You know, I'm getting close to the small battery. I'm thinking I'm going to get the small battery next. I do have the points for the other items. Well, not entirely. I mean, for the soil centrifuge, for sure. But I think that battery is going to be way more helpful here. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do the small battery. The small battery, I mean, it's something that we can easily... Lithi one lithium? No problem. We can get one lithium all over the place. So we can start pumping out a ton of batteries. I mean, the large battery is what? Like 5,000? 37. Medium battery. Uh. You know, it's kind of what's funny is that if I have played this game the way I normally play this game, I would have landed on Glacio and would have gotten enough bites to unlock, you know, all of my major pieces. So my battery, my vehicle, all of that stuff. You know, playing like this, not not doing that, not coming out and, you know, getting all the bites. Maybe you're a first time player, right? And you don't know that, hey, I can just do a kamikaze run and, and get all these guys. Um, it, it really it really limits you because you're you having to think of, you know, how to really invest your bites because you don't have a an infinite supply of bites laying around. I think that's one of the disadvantages of playing this game through once or more than once you get that understanding of oh wow i i can really just like gather so many bites somewhere else and while this farm is not the most productive farm it is constant right i mean i could move this and move the power somewhere so it's constantly grabbing off of the rocks like i did over on glacio and never have to worry about it and i probably honestly i probably will do that but it's very easy to just run around over here. I have some very close to me to get those bites and and start putting and storing them and researching them, I mean. All right, so let's let's do it. Let's do it. I'm I'm going for the small battery. Let's go over to Novus. I have an extra thruster. Let's build uh, we're gonna need a clay. We need two clays. Let's go ahead and build another oxygenator, and we're also gonna build um, a drill, drill mod. Let's get the oxygenator built. Let's get the drill mod built.
Well, let's take the bee with us. I was thinking that to leave the bee, but let's take the bee with us. Why not? I don't want to take any more of this power, so let's let's go. I don't think I'm going to set up a base there or anything. I mean, I don't know. Maybe. And Novus is another one that I don't go to quite often. I just get I typically get my resources on Vesania. Vesania has the primary for lithium. So, you know, you guys are probably going, well, why not just go to Vesania? Well, because I, I don't go to Novus that often. Let's find a nice place to land on Novus. That, I mean, that looks fine to me. Oh, let's go over here. We'll go down by the gateway. We're not super close to the gateway, but we're close enough, I guess. Oh, wow, with the render distance being so short nowadays, it is super hard. To try to figure out where stuff is at. There we go. There's some lithium. Right there. Ooh, five. I have five slots available. Okay. I don't know. I think that's, you know, I'm kind of settling, right? One, two, three, four, five. Okay. I'm kind of settling because... You can get six, right? Small battery, there we go. So you put six on. I didn't find a really good spot for lithium. So I almost don't want to... I don't want to set down the B or anything. It's not It's not worth it. Undecided. I, I don't think I want to stay here. I, I can go back to Vesania. Little disappointed. Little disappointed. I thought I was going to have a little bit better variety, but okay. It could be just this landing spot, but oh well. I'm not worried about it. Let's make up some of those little batteries. That is going to help. Immensely. Yeah, this is really going to help out. These batteries are really going to help out. That was worth getting those batteries. I can keep this base running. And it should be able to support maybe two full-time research chambers. All right, well, that's where I'm going to leave it for today. I appreciate you guys joining me. Thank you so much. If you happen to like the video, hit that like button. If you're not a subscriber, please subscribe. We'd love to have you in the community. If you want to follow me on any of my social media, you can find the links in the description below. And make sure to hit that notification bell. That way you know when I go live and when I post new videos. I'll talk to you soon. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.